Hey everyone, SMG here. Welcome back to another Odd Ones Out reaction. This one's called What Your Early 20s Will Be Like. Now, I'm actually 18, so this can actually give me some really good advice for the future. So I'm actually going to react to this right here, right now. Go watch the original video. Go subscribe to Odd Ones Out. Make sure you like this video, subscribe, ring the bell, and share. And let's get it in 3, 2, 1. Let's go. Yeah, I'm 25. That's a quarter of a century. And I've been doing YouTube full time for a nickel of a century. My life's practically five over. years. I'm at a point nice. now where when people recognize me, they'll say, OMG, James, I've been watching you since the eighth grade. And I'll be like, OMG, your beard is bigger than mine. So I've been thinking, you know, hmm. those going through puberty videos, your eighth grade science teacher shows you for some reason, the ones that are like, <laughs> hey, boys, I'm the puberty platypus. And I'm here to tell you that your body is going through some wonderful changes. I'm going, going through places. changes. Good, but that's just the wonders of life. And then for the girl one, it's like, oh, ladies, Periods. you're going to you're going to want to sit down for this one. Well, I think they need to make a puberty part yeah. two video that they show to high school seniors and prepare them better for the quote unquote adult life they're about to face. <laughs> Schools Sex. just give you a piece of paper and a funny hat and send you off into the world expecting you to figure out your intricate and complicated life through what? Trial and error? I want the puberty part two video that I'm planning on making to start like this. The puberty platypus will come back on screen and will be mm -hmm. like, well, kids, you did it. See? Puberty wasn't so bad for some of you. Yeah. Um, unfortunately, dear children, this is only the beginning. Damn. We'll start talking about all the fun things you can expect in the following years. Weak knees, like, eye strain. Uh, instead of growing hair in new places, for some of you, your hair is going to start thinning and falling out. And if you're a guy worried about hair loss, then I've got good news. This video is sponsored by ba Bald People. Oh. They're, uh, they're paying me money to tell you to just shave it all. Shave it. Looking good, Rush. You're also going wow. to be perpetually tired. And before you start thinking, I'm not going to be tired, I'm going to get eight hours of sleep every night. First of all, no, you're not. And second nope. of all, that's not going to help. You will still be tired, and there's no escape. Why do you think adults say, ha, 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 don't talk to me till I've had my coffee? It's because every adult, from the moment they wake up, is dead tired. And yeah. you need stimulants just to function. You're also going to start getting excited about things you used to think were stupid. So I'm going to have to start like drinking coffee stuff. now. Sometimes you'll go on Zillow and look at the most expensive houses and think, oh, that's a nice kitchen backsplash, and then wonder where your youth went. Another thing, 90% of the mail you get is worthless, but the other 10% of mail is very, very important. Yeah. If you ignore it, your water, power, and Wi-Fi get shut off important or you'll get mail that's like hey you owe the government some money and we know how much money you owe us but we're not going to tell you stupid so you either have to figure that out yourself or pay another person some money so they can tell you how much money you owe the government wow hey there i don't want you to be scared of growing up there's still plenty of pros no school no bedtime older. growing up beverages also, you can't escape it senior You'll discount get to be independent and make your own decisions did your parents never let you get a tattoo well now you can uh, but I'm gonna put it somewhere that I can easily cover it up when I visit them for Christmas yeah it's not weird if I exclusively wear turtlenecks around them I just I just like them Another pro, you won't yeah. complain about the food you have at home because you'll only ever buy the food you like and can afford. You're independent now. You can eat yeah. cake for breakfast. However, if you do that, your stomach will hurt and you won't be able to move for eight hours. Okay, at first yeah. you'll be able to get by with bagel bites for dinner. That's a standard college-grade meal. But after a couple of years of that abuse, your body will go, Yo, do you think you could throw down some, I don't know, fruit every once in a while? Yeah, we got yeah. Really, like, new no more bagel bites. developing brain, and we've been making them solely out of bagel bites. It is genuinely upsetting. Very I depressed. What I have to eat I'm gonna shed a three tear. times a day. There are some days where I'm hungry, but I'm not craving anything, and I know I have to eat, but I'm looking through my fridge, and I end up eating string cheese and grapes for lunch. Wow. Oh, I wish I could just unhinge my jaw and eat a month's worth of food like a snake. Do snakes only eat once a month? I don't know. I hate snakes. 50% of my driving Damn. destinations is to the grocery store, and the other 50% is drive throughs It's all food-based. Because oh, James works at home gas station. and does YouTube. Wait. 
That's just food for my car. I've been trying to eat out less, so I bought boxed frozen orange chicken instead of going to Panda Express, but then I realized I'm still eating out. I'm just heating up the orange chicken in my own microwave. Yeah. Some of you might like cooking. I don't. Whenever I cook a meal, I purposely cook Sometimes cooking can be good, sometimes need, cooking so can be bad. Meals out of only cooking it depends. One. I would rather eat progressively staler pasta all week than have to cook every day. Ugh. If you like cooking, I know one aspect of it you don't like. Cleaning up the mess afterwards. Why do you think the rule? Oh yeah, I have to do that basically exists, almost every day. Now that you're an adult, before you're making about videos, to learn, it never stops. Get used to doing the dishes and laundry because as long as you eat and sweat, those are two chores you do until the grave. Laundry is such a prevalent chore that I guarantee someone watching this yeah. video needs to put the wash into the dryer, but instead they're watching YouTube. Well, go on, leave. I don't know how I'm going to handle <laughs> folding dishes and cleaning laundry for the rest of my life. That's totally me. That's totally me. I can from it. I can hey, actually burnout, re relate I to that. Something I just learned recently called having a healthy work-life balance. Some of you might have started working from home this last year. <laughs> Welcome to the club. You now have no reason to go outside. So take it from a guy who's been working from home for five years. Go outside anyway. There's definitely yeah. benefits to working from home. Like you get to work in your pajamas and... Um, but it can be tough to work and live under the same roof. And I think a lot of young people yeah. have this mindset of being on the grind is a good thing, or at least a normal one. While it is important to work hard to achieve your goals, you need to be aware of burnout. And as a content creator who is his own boss, it's very easy yeah. to fall into an unhealthy work ethic. If you think your boss is annoying, try having a boss that lives inside your head and will not shut up about working. It could be Saturday, yeah. you're hanging out with your friends, and your Sounds boss in the back of your really head will bad. say, you could be working. There will always be work that needs to be done. You will always feel anxious about not posting. And since you technically leave the office, <sighs> yeah. you could theoretically work well into the early hours of the morning every night. Or morning, I don't know. I want to talk more about burnout and my YouTube journey and how I'm managing it, but that will be for another time because I've been yeah, working on it. That's I'm fine. Getting better, that's totally more fine. More relaxed on the weekends and going to more social settings. Vaccinated, of course. It's taken me oh, a while yeah. to the importance of a healthy work-life balance and that it's okay to work on yourself. I'm not sure if you all related to that last And part. mental health. Maybe give it a couple of years. But anyways, growing up is a part of life. Adulthood is something that you all should be looking forward to. You learn and experience so many things, and that's yeah. just your early 20s. And before I go, is there anything you want to add, Puberty Platypus? Nope. Am I ever going to find something I'm truly oh. passionate about? I drift through every day doing what feels like nothing. You can just be a regular Someone platypus if you want. Getting married and starting families, doing things that they're happy and excited about. It makes me feel even more isolated in my state of confusion and solitude. Who am I? Why don't I know myself anymore? Damn. What went wrong? We'll never know. Right. Thank you all for watching. Bagel bite. I've been working on this video for the past 25 years, so it took a while. But it would have taken 25 for the joke. more years if it wasn't for my amazing team who helped out with the production. So thank you, everyone. Also, I'm aware that Halloween is tomorrow, but if you wanted to get some Christmas shopping done, my car Well, Halloween's Cafe actually Chaos today when Target. I'm recording this. You don't even have to wait for it to ship or anything. You can just put it in your cart and go. And in other news, the wonderful Domix is unable to participate in our wonderful tour, Scribble Showdown. Oh, which I know is damn. Wonderful, Sorry, Domix. We're getting the wonderful Emerichu to fill his place. Wonderful. It was very short notice, so I'm glad she was able to drop everything and leave home for a couple of weeks. And I can't think of anyone better to sub in for Dom. That sounded... Never mind. Anyways, I hope you all have a good early 20s. Alrighty. You to start turning into adults. So have fun, stay safe, and wear your seatbelt. Alrighty. Alright guys, go watch the original video. Go subscribe to Odd Ones Out. Make sure to this video. Subscribe, ring the bell, and share. And I'll see y'all in the next video. There guys, thanks for watching and deuces.